have mass, light solar distance, just might sustain life. I'm still betting it's not worth the stop. You're only saying that because I discovered it first. Lee's got that atmospheric analysis? Hydrogen, methane, and some lethal sulfuric compounds. Sorry, everyone, it's a dead planet. Reb, there's another spacecraft orbiting this planet. Raising shields. Let's see it. What do you know? It's the same as ours. How's that possible? Jen? The General Systems J-Series of multi-purpose hyperspace craft was quite common circa 2150. Many vessels similar to deep water were built. It's hailing us. Let's keep our heads down till we know what's up. All right, show us who it is, but don't answer. Hey, anybody home over there? I can't believe it. It's you, Rip. Anybody home over there? Unidentified ship, please respond. This is Reb Anderson commanding the deep water. Through the vastness of space, a single ship carrying a crew of six speeds toward Earth. This is the story of their mission, to restore human life to a home they have never known. Anderson commanding the deep water. It's me. It looks like you. It could be a trick. It, it has to be. There aren't any other deep waters, are there, Jen? Not to my knowledge. There's no use playing dead over there, guys. Scanners see warm bodies. Six of them. And what's this? Huge amounts of biomatrix and cold storage? Take a scan of my ship and compare. Jen, do it. Scanning. Cryogenic sleep modules found. The cargo bay has been modified to contain a genetic vault. The configuration is identical to ours. It is another deep water. Shouldn't surprise us. I mean, if they can clone us once, they can clone us twice. And the same with the DNA matrices. A second ship makes good sense. Come on, guys, I'm on your side. And even if I weren't, my weapons are gone. I'm no threat. Check if you don't believe me. I will. Seems he's telling the truth. And another thing, he's hurt. What makes you say that? Well, look at him. He can't even move his left arm. He's in pain. All right, let's talk to him. Come in deep water. Do you read? My God. So they did launch a second deep water. Stand by, Deep Water One. We're sending a shuttle. That ship is taking a huge beating. At least your tractor beams still work. Sorry, I had to come. get me. Um, both my shuttles are out of commission. No apology necessary. Okay, lots of scar tissue, some nerve damage. I need to get you to our sick bay. After I talk to your crew. Shuttle Malpo's back aboard. Let's go. Is that necessary? Sure hope not. But it stays. Ooh, I feel safer already. Give him a break. After all, we don't know the man. Don't be such a skeptic. Of course we know who the man is, Zach. That's where we got hit. And that's who hit us. Here's your drink, Rebel. Same 
same sector, same gang, different ship. And they ambushed you, like they did us. One minute I was in cryo sleep, and the next alarms are screaming, and I'm being thawed out. What happened to the rest of the crew? We were hit too hard and too fast, and both the computer and the cryo systems were blown out before they could be fully revived. You had to fight off the attack alone? With no computer. Before they could finish us off, I figured a way to shunt all power to my last working gun. One shot, and I made it count. They ran off, but they crippled the deep water. Only hyperdrive lasted long enough to make it to this star system. Then it failed too. Well, you can thank the deep water designers for sending out a backup ship. Yeah. I guess that makes us deep water too. There may even be more than two. It's possible. Okay, that's enough. Our gene bank is still intact, so the mission goes as planned. Are you crazy, kid? Forget the gene bank. Forget about reaching Earth. Let's just get out of this sector and find an inhabitable planet before those butchers track us down. We're outmatched in these flying coffins. Maybe. Maybe not. But we're not quitting. You're a stubborn kid, aren't you? Who are you calling a kid, old man? Okay, hotshot. If you're a game, so am I. Let's go see what we can do with my ship. There may be something we can salvage. You're staying here. Salvage? Hell, I'll get it running again. Where, where's my patient? He's on his way to sick bay. And the engines aren't responding at all. I'll go take a look at him. What are you doing? Some of this memory's clean. I bet I can restore the ship's log. Why bother? We know what happened to him. And besides, there are more important things to fix. He's right, Zack. Why don't you take a look at the helm? What's the matter with that hell? Nothing. Just dodging an argument. Keep doing what you're doing. You're not the only one who wants to see that log. It's going to take a few days for the strength to come back. Oh. Well, no complaints here. Matter of fact, as far as I'm concerned, you deserve a medal. You all do. <laughs> for what? For surviving, keeping the faith, and getting along. Well, you should see us on a bad day. Well, I never even got to know my crew. What are they like, your shipmates? You really want to know? Yeah. I hardly know where to begin. Well, start with Yuna. That's got it. Think. Starboard guns are down. Oh, bring us around. Our shields are failing. Just give me one more shot of their app generators. Hang on. Now or never. exercise and you're good as new. But just don't overdo it, okay? Somebody help me, the doctor's been hurt. Why didn't he tell us she was there? Maybe he didn't want to let us in on his real agenda. That no one gives more sorted out. Help me get on the table. Come on!
Jen, voice verification, who am I? You are Reb Anderson. In command of the deep water, correct? Correct. Very well. Maintain radio silence, power up the hyperdrive, and prepare to leave orbit. Yuna, look at this. There's a shuttle launching from Deepwater 2. He's hijacking our ship! Deepwater 2 is leaving orbit. I'm going after her. How's that again? Shuttle Alpha has launched from Deepwater One and is in pursuit. Open the channel. Channel open. Ahoy, Shuttle Alpha. Turn back. Not a chance. Give back my ship. I'm sorry, I'm on a mission of my own. Forget that mission. I'm coming for my ship. Head back. Now, or you won't have enough fuel to make it. I'm not turning back. With Deepwater One's engines out, they can't come after me. So, I guess I'm stuck here until my oxygen's gone. Unless you stop and bring me aboard. Head back! I'm not stopping, you'll die! You'll stop. You won't let me die. Not again. I saw the ship's log. I know what happened. I'm sorry. I know it for less than nine days. Then we were attacked. I've spent the last year thinking about her. She saved my life. I know. You promised her revenge. You know what? This is not the way. It's not just revenge I'm after. Sooner or later, those murderers will be back. I took your ship because I wanted to find them first. You said it yourself. I can't let you die again. Well, who says anybody has to die? Why can't we all survive? We stand a much better chance if we do this together. We can fix your ship. With you and the two deep waters, we can beat them. Please, don't give up. Join us. Please. Deep water one, this is deep water two. I'm turning the ship over to Yuna. We're on our way back. Acknowledge, Deepwater 2. We'll shuttle over as soon as you resume orbit. Apology accepted. And appreciated. Now I think it's time to move on, agreed? Agreed. Okay then. Deepwater 1's a wreck. Her engines are junk. And we may manage to salvage a few parts, but frankly, I don't think it's worth the effort. What happened to all that youthful optimism? You tell me, old man. Um, with your permission, I'd like to board her and retrieve some personal effects. Of 
Of course. Unit can shuttle you over. You know, you really don't need to come along. I can fly a shuttle on my own. You're uncomfortable being around me. Well, yeah. Do you blame me? No. I don't take it personally. You should take it as a compliment. I'll have Brent take my place. Um, I'm going over to the deep water to say goodbye. I'd prefer to do that on my own. I understand. <laughs> Firing range in two minutes. Deep water one, I repeat, get out of there. Deep water one, do you hear me? Loud and clear, but I'm staying. You've got no engines and only two guns. There's nothing you can do over there. Watch me, kid. Don't be stupid. Abandon ship. Get to the shuttle. I've jettisoned the shuttle. You'll be able to retrieve it later, I hope. Now break over and get deep water two to safety. Don't do this. Let us come and get you. I don't belong there. It's your ship and your lives. Reb, take care of her. One day you'll see just how precious she is. Stop it! We can still save you! There's nothing to save here but a wish for revenge. And I'm about to get my wish. Now clear out. Fulfill your mission. Deep water one out. Get him back. I'm trying, but he's not answering. Incoming fire. Shield holding, but not for long. Return fire. Shield deck. One quarter. His must be a little gone. Yuna, get us between him and the enemy ship. We've got to take some of the heat off. He's locked on tractor beams. Deep water one's moving. And he shut down the fusion dampers. He's gonna self-destruct. Yuna, get us clear now. First, he's ready to sacrifice our ship for his revenge. And next, he's telling me to take care of her. You mean the deep water? Well, yeah. When he said, right? One day you'll see how precious she is. <laughs> She's a first-rate ship, but... She's still just a ship. She's nothing to get poetic about. 
Well, maybe in ten years' time we'll feel different. Maybe we'll see things then that we don't see now. I guess. I just wish I understood him, that's all. I mean, he was me.